know you're trying to get a clip for the intro. I have some prepared for you. Makeup. Oh, we can't afford that. My name is Ben Wolverton. I'm the marketing director here at The Thunder, and I'm from Crosswicks, New Jersey. I went to Mercer County Community College for television production. I've been at The Thunder for 11 years. This is my 11th season, and uh, it's my first real job. I started here during college when I was 18 as a camera internship. Um, before that, my first job was when I was 10 or 11, taking care of some ponies at a um, local fair. Um, scooping up their leftovers and taking some pictures of kids on ponies. So that was really customer service, uh, albeit a little smelly. Um, and then I did a camera internship here after that and refused to leave and here I am. My favorite part about the director of marketing is how open-ended it is. Um, I get to run around the ballpark with a camera and take photos of fans having a good time, execute the promotions that we do, so it's working with both the sales team and the ticket team, but then also helping to execute the between-inning promotions. You know, we spend all off-season working with the sponsorship team and the ticket team, uh, but then when it comes right down to it during the game, the fans are our boss and uh, feeling the mood of the ballpark and getting the fans as, as involved as possible. So as soon as the gates are open, um, I'm finishing up my meeting with the promo staff who are the ambassadors of the Trenton Thunder who spread out throughout the ballpark and get people to sign up for the games. And I help with that, make sure they're doing what they need to be doing. And then I'm on the field during pregame, taking pictures, helping first pitches go. And then throughout the game, I just continue taking pictures that go on thundermoments.com. Uh, sometimes holding the bats or doing the air horn for Dizzy Bat, really whatever needs to happen because every game is different. So on a regular non-game day during the season, it's playing catch-up. It is um, sometimes groups request to be in promos ahead of time, which is actually really good for us um, and saves time game day. So I'm organizing that, making sure they know what time to get to fan services. Uh, washing all the Boomer's outfits because he wears a lot of different outfits during the game, whether it's Pork Roll Friday or our Trueno games, making sure he's ready to go, and then doing the scheduling for my team of, you know, 20 people, something like that. And also all the fire tweets, as the kids say. No cap. So in the off season, I take part in as many different departments as possible. I sell sponsorship, I sell group tickets, um, but it's upkeep of the website and social media, making it as easy as possible for fans to find what they need to find. Every year I'm also involved in all of the announcements um, that we do, like this year we had Boomer for the People and uh, the new Pork Roll rebrand, all that kind of stuff. Not only what do we tell the fans, uh, but also how we say it. Um, it's just as important, you know, is it a video? Is it a, a press release that gets sent to media partners? Is it a, a mascot? press conference at a school with hundreds of screaming children. Um, that one worked out really well. My favorite part of the ballpark is one that barely anybody gets to see, apart from the players and uh, the promo staff. It's the dugout tunnel. My favorite part during a game is the anticipation right before a promotion runs out there. We're sitting in there, you know, baseball can, uh, an inning can take a minute or a full half hour and the contestants are sitting there, the kids are in their lemon costumes or pizza costumes or whatever silly thing we're doing, and we're just waiting for that inning to be over, and then we sprint out to the field, and then we do the promotion, and then we sprint off so that the baseball can continue. Um, I just like being in that tunnel. We have been working on this season since the last game of last season, and working our butts off for promotions and giveaways and theme nights, and everything that happened and now all we need is for fans to show up and based on the pre-sale there's going to be a lot of people here we want you all summer long 